Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to V-Step 6. I know it's been five months since our last upload. Have no fear, we're here in our new studio. So don't forget to leave a comment down below. Eh? Xin chào tất cả các bạn. Cuối cùng chúng tôi cũng quay trở lại với V-Step 6 sau 5 tháng gián đoạn. Đây là phòng thu mới của chúng tôi. Các bạn nghĩ như thế nào? Hãy cho chúng tôi biết ở phần comment nhé. Ready to do this? Ready! Let's do it. One social interaction. Topic one: hometown. Where do you come from? I am from a pretty coastal area just outside Hạ Long in the northeast of Vietnam. It has Hạ Long Bay, which is recognized as the World Heritage Site by UNESCO for its thousands of natural islands. Do you like living in your hometown? Yes, I truly do. Early mornings and late afternoons after my hectic working day, I absolutely enjoy my walks or runs along the beach with the nice clean sea air. What is it famous for? It is well known because of its stunning limestone mountains rising up from the emerald waters that from thousands of years ago, they are breathtaking. And you also can explore amazing caves as well as the culture of Ha Long. Topic 2. Career. What is your job? I work as an administrator in a private company. I give customers the information they want and give them suggestions based on our service. How long have you been working there? I have been working here for 8 years which is not too short, not too long, but I have gained much needed experience. Do you like working there? If yes, why? Yes, I really do. I love helping people solve their difficulties. Moreover, I've learned new skills to keep up with new technology and this makes my job smoother. Part 2 Situation Discussion Your town plans to organize an open festival and many visitors will come. Which job below do you think would be the most suitable for you? A tour guide? A traffic director? Or a master of ceremonies, an MC? An open festival in my town would need a lot of workforce. I think I would like to have as a tour guide for the following reasons. First of all, I can speak English. Therefore, I can communicate with visitors who are unable to speak Vietnamese. Secondly, I know my hometown well, especially the tourist attractions, as well as the best services. As a result, I could make special trips with them to show them important places around the town. Furthermore, I would help them try some of the local specialties from the area without paying extra fees. Okay. Last but not least, I seem to have the right qualification for this job. I am enthusiastic and friendly. I am able to interact with people from different backgrounds and I absolutely want to promote my town maybe they will return in the future I have the ability of working in a team too 
while I haven't got any experience as an MC and I guess I'm not that confident on stage. Moreover, I might not get used to working outdoors in traffic or the heat as the traffic director. Therefore, it wouldn't be the best use of my skills. To sum up, being a tour guide would be the most suitable for me. It seems that directing traffic is the best fit for me to help out with the open festival due to these reasons. First and foremost, I fancy outdoor activities a lot. This always brings me energy and joy. I love watching people and the activities too. Therefore, I wouldn't mind being out there guiding visitors to make their trips more effortless and meaningful. Secondly, I know my town so well that I could tell tourists how to get to the desired destination fast and easily. That's why the visitor would feel relaxed and enjoy their journey anywhere. Okay. What's more, I love working in a team and getting extra life experience. I believe I can work in harmony with others and build effectively teams. In contrast, working as MC needs some experience speaking publicly or presenting information to a large group of people. I am afraid that it will take me time to practice this and build the confidence needed, seeing I haven't got any experience doing so. This would not be a good situation for me to be in. Okay. In addition, I might have all the information about our hometown's tourist attractions in books and could research the internet, but I haven't visited many of them for years. I have heard many facilities have changed recently, therefore I would worry if my knowledge and stories would be engaging enough for the visitors. In closing, I would choose to be a traffic director. If the open festival offered the position an MC, I would definitely take it thanks to the advantages below. First of all, I love challenging myself and learning new skills. I would be trained to perform in the event professionally, hence I'm sure I would learn something new and interesting. To push myself and reach new limits. When you really want to do something, you can do it. Next. I suppose I have the right disposition to be an MC for this festival. As most people know, I am friendly and outgoing. Besides, I have a good sense of humor and athlete skills, as well as the ability to put people at ease and the ability to improvise. I just need the rehearse because it says, practice makes Perfect. Okay. However, working as a traffic director would be physically challenging for me since I have gotten used to working in an office. However, being a tour guide for the festival could make me work at night or even overnight at different locations, which would not be convenient for me. To sum up, an MC would be the best for me. Part 3 Topic Development 
discuss the topic, smoking should be banned in public places, as guided in the outline below. Some smokers may believe their risky habit does not have impact on people surrounding them. However, science tells a different alarming story. Smoking should be banned in all public places because in the long term, people exposed to secondhand smoke have a greater risk of suffering from breathing problems such as increasing coughing, wheezing, pneumonia, asthma, and all kinds of other diseases such as heart disease, stroke, nasal sinus cancer, and lung cancer. What about smokers' health? It is no secret that smoking is one of the leading causes of preventable premature death. Some of the long-term effects of smoking that they may experience including increased risk of soak and brain damage, loss of sense of smell and taste, yellow teeth, tooth decay, and bad breath, cancer of the nose, lip, tongue, and mouth. Okay. Besides that, it is costly to have this habit. The cost of smoking cigarettes is not only an everyday financial expense, it can lead to the higher cost to health and life insurance, high health care costs due to smoke-related um, units, and, and this exposes your loved one to the harmful chemicals in cigarette smoke that have negative impacts on their health. From my point of view, it is someone's right to tool to smoke, but this can't have a bad influence on others. Do you smoke? No, I never, I never even tried. I don't see the need to experience such a thing. Why do many people want to smoke? Many people smoke because it is one of the ways that they have learned to deal with negative moods and the stress of day-to-day -day life. Unfortunately, they didn't figure out that there are other ways to cope with emotions without smoking. Last question. What should we do to prevent smoking in public places? It seems to me that all the laws of smoking in public areas were enacted as well as increased taxation of tobacco products, stricter laws regulating who can purchase tobacco products, who and where they can be purchased, where and when they can be used. Now, we just need to enforce them. <music>